Hi, everyone. In just the last hour, the city of Austin has announced more details concerning this weekend's New Year's Eve celebrations. KXAN's Kate Whitehall has the details from City Hall. Good afternoon. Well, the city has allocated about $50,000 to put on a family-friendly, alcohol-free event down at Auditorium Shores on New Year's Eve, beginning at 5 o'clock that Saturday afternoon. Now, inside City Hall this morning, city officials announced their overall plan. There will be several stages down at Auditorium Shores with musical acts beginning with Joe McDermott on the main stage. Several films made by local directors will be showing on the big screen. They're going to have performances by actors and theatrical groups. And then it's all going to wrap up with a fireworks display around 10 o'clock after Carolyn Wonderland wraps up her performance. But Austin's fire chief wants to remind folks that this is really the only fireworks allowed on New Year's Eve. And even though we have had some rain, uh, we are still in drought conditions and uh, a burn ban is actually in effect within the city at all times and that has not been lifted or are there no exceptions to that other than the commercial display for the fireworks. Now, as far as transportation is concerned, Sober Ride is not going to be operating this year, although there will be extra cabs. Also, for the first time, Capital Metro is teaming up with the Austin Police Department to offer free service on their night owl routes. Now, that is going to begin from midnight until 3 a.m., and most of the buses can be picked up at Congress and 6th Streets. At Austin City Hall, Kate Wydaw, KXAN News.